Hello and welcome back to another episode of Minecraft Legends. We are in the fray protecting this village from these horrible piglins. It, it, it turned out it wasn't all that... Oh, there's more of them. I was going to say, it turned out it wasn't all that difficult. I don't think it will be, to be honest. Because... No, uh, but, oh, there's more here. So at night time, you can see the piglins get little red eyes, and that means they're a bit more vicious. It'd be nice if I could see like, on the radar where they were... I don't seem to be able to, but I'm sure there's more about because it haven't, hasn't said that I've won. I can hear them. Oh, there we go. There's one. There's one left. Where? Where is it? Hmm. See arrows being fired. Hmm. Piglins are gone, but fountain still needs repair. How do I repair it? Can I repair it? Oh. All right then. Right. Well, that all, all worked out well, I guess. Um, now fast travel to this village. I already can fast travel to... The, oh, my goodness me. Right. Okay. Well, now that's safe, then. I think it's time to uh, go back to where I was fighting this. And I don't have a fast travel point there, so I'm going to have to fast travel back to there and then uh, make my way over to it. <laughs> Great. Yeah. Um, not quite how I expected this this to go, really. Uh, this game, just like wandering about a lot. I don't feel like this is the sort of game where exploration is really all that necessary, to be honest with you. So, I mean, obviously there's fast travel points, which means you can avoid a lot of that exploration. But, um, yeah, it just seems odd that it's like, oh, you got to go over there now, mid-battle. Oh, you got to go over there now. Um, but I'm busy, mate. Busy over here. And I don't have a fast travel there. But it's all right, because these piglins are going to be gone in a minute. I've seen it and looking very, very hard with my eyes for iron. Come on, dogs. Might as well come with us. <laughs> I thought you said the dogs don't do anything. They don't. They do nothing. Right. Recall, everybody. Make more guys. Everybody's full. Oh, great. So I've got a load of arrow shooting guys which are pretty much useless against buildings but hopefully they can help us with the uh, structures a bit and with a bit of luck and this sounds horrible but they'll all die in a minute <laughs> and then i can get some more of the stone the stone guys i'm just gonna smash as many of these guys as possible well those guys all do shootings and bangs and getting rid of all of those things and they will all be good So lapis seems to be a thing that you're never running out of in this. Lapis, obviously you get lapis for the killing the piglins, piglins, and there's a lot of them. But I see more lapis despawning, particularly in the PvP thing, than I do picking it up. Oh, and I'm nearly dead again. I've got to be careful here. All right, go back over here. See if I can get some more of those rocky guys now. Would be very useful if I could. Plus game. I can. Excellent. Obviously it costs us a little bit of lapis for this. But not much. Oh wow, I can make loads of those. We lost a lot. We lost a lost a lot of guys that time. Come on. Time to go and do it again. Alright guys. I'm going to give you your objective. Your objective is simple. Smash kill and I'll try and get rid of as many of these guys on the way as I can for you so you can all just get in there there we go took that thing down right everybody kill that tower please oh I died okay oh so you do just respawn in 10 seconds I kind of want it I know that sounds daft but I kind of wanted to die just to see what happened 
Uh, so I wasn't too worried about doing that. But I'm probably going to be right back at the... Yeah, at the Well of Faith. Because I am. Or whatever it is. The Well of something or other. All right, I guess I'm off again, guys. See you in a minute. Jays. Just keep running over the same bit over and over again. So it would be nice if uh, it had other Minecraft mechanics, like, um, you know, respawn would be nice. But uh, I guess that's not a thing here. No, I, I mean, put your bed down to respawn is what I meant. Jeez. Sorry. I'm concentrating. Jeez. Give me a break, guys. I can't think of everything all at the same time. I'm not a genius. But you said you were a genius. Well, I am a bit, actually. A bit of a genius. Still not seeing any iron on the way in here. Right, let's head back up here. Spawning a whole bunch more golems because they're probably all dead. And go and take on a bunch more piglins. Playing me little metal melody. Spawn them in. There we go. Come on, guys. It's piglin smashing time. All right, I wonder if we can uh, work this a bit better. I wish they wouldn't attack the piglins on the way through. I kind of like them to just, like, just follow me, basically. All right, break down that tower. And I'll go and gather some more lapis. Oh, I am taking some damage. Okay, I got some more prismarine from that. So, obviously, I didn't get the prismarine from the thing before because... I wandered off, which wasn't ideal. Oh, there's a chest here. What's in the chest? Need a piglin key. Oh, jeez. Where do I get a piglin key from? I do need to be a little bit careful here again, because I don't really want to die and come all that way again. I seem to be doing a good job. My little rock smashing guy. Oh, no. Time to retreat. Ah, no, don't go in the book. Run away. War. Make haste. Down to 50%. That's good news. 49%. They're still going. They're doing a good job. Okay, let's make some more. I need... I desperate, desperately need some more... Uh, of the Prismarine Shards. Really do with some more of those. So uh, I think we just have to go around and destroy... Once we got rid of that thing, we can probably go and, uh, like... What's the word I'm looking for? Just smash all the buildings to bits, I guess, afterwards, is what I'm trying to say. Here we go, 24%. We're getting there slowly but surely. I'm going to die again in a minute. Run away. You guys crack on. You guys carry on. I'll go make some more reinforcements. So it's quite a repetitive strategy, this thing. Ah, oh, Dawn, piglins are planning. The piglins are drawing up plans for the next invasion. And they can draw up plans all they want. That's fine. But yeah, once we get further along, I'm hoping we get to do some of the base building stuff that was in the PvP, because that's the most fun, is when you're, like, building structures and stuff on the go. That's really good fun. Oh, jeez. I'm taking a beating. Come on, guys. You can do this. There's only a couple of them left. You got this, guys. I don't think they got this, guys. That's a lot of piglins. Okay, right. Strategy number two, then. What we're going to do this time is we're going to build some of the arrow guys, go in and take care of a few of those piglins. What, what, I don't want it up there. No, I don't want it up there. There we go. And then, um, then we'll get some more of the rock guys. Let's just call everybody back. Not that there's going to be many left. No, they're all dead. Literally all dead. Okay. So these guys will help me take care of the uh, the piglins. And then we'll grab a couple of these if we can. Come on, guys. <laughs> One just literally fell off the cliff. Good job. I'm going the wrong way. Come on. This way. 
this way, little army. And here we go. Just go and attack that thing. And I'll try and get rid of as many piglins as possible. Well, that's a lot of piglins. Ow. Ow. Don't hit me rock, guys. I need them. 5%. Come on, rock guys. You got this. How hard could it be? There we go. All of a sudden, we're not there anymore. Oh, well, they're all popping back through. Bye. We got it. Surely that's going to give us like a hundred prismarine or something. There's a lot of cutscenes in this. Dear. Hmm. Yeah, well, he wasn't a happy chappy, was he? And I'm just sat here burning. Good. Oh, it's all just like destroying itself. Oh, we got Piglin Key though. So do I not get to just the destroy the rest of the? Oh, there's Prismarine. Prismarine. Many, many Prismarine. Stay vigilant. They are the most ferocious and vindictive of the Great Hog's generals. This is the Horde of the Bastion. They build great walls and have strong armor. You must breach both. No, 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 don't disappear, Prismarine. Okay, so it looks like it's going to be very important to take on all of the little things that generate Prismarine in, in future first before destroying the portal, because I think I missed a whole bunch of it then. Oh, that's a shame. They stash away for the Horde. Okay. Well, we've done that, so that's good. Now, will we get any Prismarine for destroying whatever this thing is? Probably not. No, they're just going to run past it, so they don't care about that. Okay. Well, that's one down. Looks like there's a whole uh, load of gold in there as well, but we can't actually dig up gold yet because I haven't made that improvement. But I guess now would be a good time to go home and uh, and build some improvements Let's smash these piglins to bits before we go get a little, last little bit of lapis if we can not giving us any lapis now why are you not giving me lapis mate wow rude okay no problem time to go home oh is this one that's going to be under attack at the night okay attack this village when the sun sets tonight yeah I'm kind of picking it up, guys. I'm picking up what you're putting down. Oh. What? What happened? That looks like a piece of a piglin banner. The skeleton's car just provoked the wrath of the piglins. Not just the skeletons. Revenge has come to all of our friends, I am afraid. Oh, Is this the price of their bravery? Oh, little skeleton. Well, that's the price of your bravery, I'm afraid. Literally, this skeleton's alive. Right. Okay, so I want to be able to... Hmm, gather redstone would be useful. So let's have this. That's going to cost us 100 prismarine. Is redstone going to be helpful at this point, though? Or is something else going to be useful? What do I need for that? 200 thingies. Mm. Coal or redstone? I'm going to go redstone because it's the next one in the list. It makes sense to me to do it that way. Build that for me, please. I know. That's why I did it, mate. And there we go. Look at that. That's just opened up. So we can have alley storage to provide us with, uh, well, the amount of resources we can carry. We can now have abundant allays, which means we can actually have the amount of allays increased. Improvement banner, which allows you to actually control more mobs at once. 
the large flames and the flames of creation, which I think allows you to build bigger armies of mobs. And then these things as well. So we've got an improvement carventry, whatever that does. And we've got the improvement expert mason, uh, whatever that does. So, oh, increases building speed. And this one improves the ability to raise and repair your structures. So there's a whole bunch of things we've just unlocked, which is great. We've unlocked some more things in here. We can now make a redstone launcher. We can make a masonry, which might not be a bad idea. We just need a little bit more iron. A battle drum, which actually improves the speed at which your uh, like turrets and your red launchers and stuff fire. And a well house, uh, which is our respawn point. You know, I was talking about beds a minute ago, and now I'm like, oh, there it is. <laughs> okay, yes, yeah, brain kicked in finally. So we're pretty much out of Prismarine now. We can't really build a great deal else. Um, I believe all of those things are going to cost Prismarine. I guess. Let's uh, let's have a look in here. Yeah, all of the wow and a lot of Prismarine as well. But these things don't. So we could probably put a couple of these things on a hotbar if we needed to. Although it looks like a hotbar is already pretty much full of those. I would like to build the masonry. What do I need for that? I need a little bit more iron. So let's go on an iron finding mission and hopefully we'll find some redstone as well. Now there was a jungle in this direction, I believe. Which means we'll go and find all of that tasty redstone. And there was a bit of iron kicking around in this uh, plains as well. So fingers crossed we'll come across that again on the way out. And we can start building up our stuff a bit better. There we go, there's a bit of iron there. Oh, there's another pile of iron over there. Very nice. I'll take it. Very good. Little delays. Ah, now we've got enough iron to build the masonry, so that's good. So that means things will start getting built a little bit quicker. And there's a big old pile of redstone over here. And another one over there. Oh, good. Yes, I'll have one of those. I'll have one of those. And I will have one of those. Thank you. Amazing. Oh, this grass, by the way, this stuff, that makes you run faster. Just, just in case you were interested. Don't care. Okay, that's fine. Don't have to. That's fine. But it's it's helpful, you see. So how much iron can we actually carry now that I improved our iron supply thing? I don't know. It's not letting me put down any more things. We've got two, they are lazy too busy, so we really could be doing with a few more relays as well. No, these ones are free again now. Let's just stock up as much as we can on these things while we're in the area. Might as well. A little bit more redstone here. Come on, little Alays. You got this. Look at him. Gathering the... Ow, 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 ow. What, what's doing me damage? A pile of redstone there. Ow. 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 Oh, jeez. He's doing a lot of damage. Another pile of redstone there. All right, okay. We're maxed out at 300 uh, iron then. And I think we'll probably only be able to do 250 redstone. So, I guess each one of the, like, upgrades for iron and resto redstone just gives you another 50 in your slot, which isn't all that many, really, considering how much, like, stone and wood you can carry. It seems very limited with the other stuff. But that's fine. That's absolutely fine. Yeah, we're max... Oh, 150 we've maxed out on redstone, so we're going to need a lot of improvement upgrades for that then. Oh, jeez. Would be very expensive. Very expensive. Right. Okay. What we uh, let's recall our army. Have we got any army guys left? No. No, of course not. Why would we have army guys left? That doesn't make any sense. Right. What can we build? I want to build some more stuff. I want to build the masonry. There it is. I got it here. Pop it just down there next to this thing. Just there. Look out, skeleton! You're about to get built on. I can't build any of those things yet. And that's taken us back down to 100 iron. That's fine. That's absolutely fine. So this hopefully will mean we'll build things a little quicker. Let's just check the book again. Structures will visually change over time to indicate mainstream is strengthening them. Oh, so that makes things stronger. Right. So what was the one... What was this thing, wasn't it? The expert mason up to a utility upgrade to the masonry, increasing speed at which it converts the structures, enhancing the auras of the masonry. So basically, yeah, it makes things a little bit stronger, maybe? Hmm, okay. So there we go. So you'll start seeing now, now that we've got that, some of the um, 
the stone or the wooden walls. There we go. Looks already happening. We'll start turning it into stone walls. All on their very own, which is lovely. So um, I guess it's probably a good time to go and take on some more piglins. We're already down to two over there. A skeleton homestead. The skeletons are brave, but they will not last long on their own. We've got to protect those as well. The creepers uh, are resilient, but they will be overrun if you do not help them. Oh, jeez. The zombies are defenseless against the cruelty of the piglins. Please, you must help them. And then we've got this village to do at night time as well. The piglins have set their sights on this village. Hmm. It would probably be a good idea to start throwing down some well houses around this place. I kind of want to go back to that again. Um, it says it requires wake the firsts. I don't know if that means we need to build it yet or if we can just go to it. So I'm going to fast travel to this village. But might not be so lucky next time. Uh, and see if we can pop a little map marker down for that and head over there. Because it said we needed some resources last time that we went over to this, but it didn't tell us what. Well, it did tell us what, but I can't remember what. So we'll find out, won't we? We will find out. And hopefully on our little travels, we'll explore and find more things, more resources, and ideally a new mount. Would be nice to have a new mount. Not that my little wonky don donkey isn't totally lovely and all that and everything, mate, but it's a... Uh, oh, jeez. He's, he's a bit slow. He's a little slow. He's not the fastest wonky donkey I've ever come across. So what do we need for this? No, okay. So I've got to build that one first. And that costs... 100 gold, which we've got. A bunch of wood. Oh, so I, so I could build that already. Does that not cost prismarine? Okay, so let's go... Come back over here. Jeez. Here we are, guys. I'm home. No, and now it wants me to... Now it says it's going to cost 100 things. Great. Thanks, game. Why couldn't you have told me that a minute ago? Right. Uh, the skeletons, I believe, were in quite a lot of trouble. Brave, but they will not last long on their own. But it's going to be easier for us to get over to these things first. Just because they're closer, I think. For now. We should have put a well over there by those. It would be nice to have a well over here, I think. Maybe we should head over in that direction. Let's, let's pop a thing down there and let's put a well over here. Come on, guys. Let's do this through the mountains where all the diamonds live. And it'll be nighttime again before you know it and then I'll have to go somewhere else. But at least, hopefully, we'll get... Oh, what do I need to build a well house? Oh, I haven't got enough prismarine! Okay, forget that then. I'm going to go straight for the creepers. Thanks. Don't worry, creepers. I will save you. I got this, guys. Look, diamonds. Find them. I can't. It's not allowed, mate. The one thing I haven't seen in this game at all, and there's been absolutely no reference to them at all, are Endermen. So I can only assume there will be some DLC at some point that opens up the end or yeah, has something to do with the end. Because again, as I was saying at the end of the live stream, this is substantially lacking in a lot of... Oh, yes. What is it? Eager to help. Some iron. Yeah, it's substantially lacking in a lot of areas. Whilst it looks complicated from the outside, it's actually very, very simple. There's not all that much going on. There really aren't that many, like, units and things you can build. It's very, very... There's not... Yeah, there's really not that many units and things you can build at all. And So the strategy side of thing is very, very light on strategy. So I'm hoping that there, there, there are lots of plans for advancements and things. And I hope it's not just all paid DLC. The there is a marketplace on here and it takes mine coins, but it's full of rubbish, very expensive rubbish, and there's only like 14 things in there. Don't you make... Oh my goodness, that poor creeper. Serves you right there, bro. Serves you right, mate. And now all suffer. This must stop. 
Don't worry, little creepers. I got this. Okay, so this is versus piglins rather than versus structures. So I am going to go and build myself uh, some of these guys. Oh, I can build, like, defenses and st things here as well. That could be useful. Have I got anyone I can recall? Build them all! Come on. Let's just stand around, guys. So I can just build turrets in the middle of this playing area, and hopefully... That means that the piglins will, uh, yeah, they'll just be able to, like, fire at the piglins. Which is kind of handy, because there's no netherrack here, which is good. So let's just pop another one down over there. Ooh, okay. This is kind of like a little mini boss fight, I guess. I'll just keep it swinging my sword. Oh, that took a lot of damage then. Okay. Have another one of those. Yeah, it's kind of working. Oh, there's another big guy there. Okay, so they can knock our stuff down pretty quickly. And there's a lot of piglins. I don't know if they're respawning. I can't see any, like, of their spawners anywhere. But I don't know if I just need to go and unlock, like, the, the cages to let the creepers out. Or whether... Or whether I just need to beat everyone up first. I guess I just need to go and unlock everything. Have another few towers, guys. Oh. Did I do it? Was that it? You did it! The creepers found their bravery once more. Thanks to Yay. you. Yay! Finish oh. that portal and help them free their home. Oh, hang on. I'd, ra I'd rather not. I'm going to die. It wants me to take on the portal now as well? Oh, jeez. Let's just start, stand here behind these defences. Um, But the, the portal... It looks... There isn't a portal on the map. What? What do I need for that? I need more prismarine stuff. Hmm. Okay, well, I guess we can go and, uh... Let's recall everyone over here. No mobs, they're all dead. Great. Do I get resources back from destroying things? A little bit. Okay, let's take a few of these things down, then. Get some resources back. And we move slightly closer to the piglins. Come on, little creepers. Go blow up this guy. He's not very nice. It'd be nice if they had like a health bar so you can see how much damage you were doing. I don't seem to be doing anything to him at all. And there's loads of them still over here. Absolutely tons. Wow, and I'm, I'm taking a lot of damage again. Okay, time to get out of here. Run away. Come on, wonky donkey. Protect me. Oh, and it's becoming night. Is it becoming nighttime again, or is it just because I'm close to them? If it's becoming nighttime again, that's going to be a problem. I, then I need to go and protect that other village. Yeah, it is. Oh, jeez. But I'm not finished here, and it's so far away from everything i got to go protect this village now. Oh, jeez. 
which I guess I'm going to have to do in the next episode. Thank you all very much for watching. I'll see you all in the next one. Goodbye.